Did Captain Rex's inhibitor chip ever work? In my opinion, no, it never worked. There is evidence to support this. The strongest of which is that after Rex had his inhibitor chip removed, there is no noticeable changes in his personality or behavior, which is unlike Wolf and Gregor. Since Wolf became paranoid and Gregor became both paranoid and crazy. Now I do want to admit that Gregor's craziness could be due to being in that large explosion that we saw in the Clone Wars. But he's still paranoid just like Wolf. And you, and also when you look at Fives from the Clone Wars, he discovered the inhibitor chips outright and when he had his removed, he became paranoid. Conspiracy theory paranoid. That kind of paranoid. This leads me to conclude that when a clone has his inhibitor chip removed, he becomes paranoid. But Captain Rex does not become paranoid. He has no noticeable personality changes. This leads me to conclude that Captain Rex's inhibitor chip never worked. I can sense some of you are reaching for your keyboard to type. Then Captain Rex should have been paranoid from the beginning or the like. Before you press comment, hear me out. It is the removal of a functional inhibitor chip that causes the clone to become paranoid. If you remove an inhibitor chip that never affected the clone, then why would the clone's personality change if you removed it? It, it had no effect. And that's why I believe Captain Rex's inhibitor chip never worked because his, the removal of it never never showed any sign of affecting his personality like the three examples I've listed out. So let me know down in the comments below, do you believe that Captain Rex's inhibitor chip ever worked? Let me know your opinions to that down below and also what do you think of my theory? O offer some other evidence in support of it and if you disagree, let me know why. I would love to hear from you. May the force be with you, always. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to my channel for future content. Check out my other channels, Johnson Berry, The Art and History Channel, and John Berry Gaming. Check, check me out on social media, Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus. Support me on Patreon, and check out my website. Links are in the description down below. Have a good day, a good night, wherever you are. Have a good one.